Hey everybody, I'm Tim here with some cigars that you can actually get your hands on right now. You're watching Cigars Daily. Get more out of this video when you watch it on CigarsDailyPlus.com because we're always working to make it better on Cigars Daily Plus. Availability. It's the new buzzword out there. The thing that's on everybody's lips because, well, nothing's really available. No matter what you do, no matter what industry you work in, or what type of items and products you use, you're waiting on something to come in, if it ever comes in at all. And the supply chain disruptions that we've been seeing in the world today, it's frustrating. So much more than just an unwelcome opportunity to teach our kids patience because we're actually having to learn patience and that's up. So today I wanted to take you guys inside some cigars, ones you can actually find and get your hands on. This is something that's become a huge deal, especially as some of the most popular cigars on the market have been kind of hard to come by. I know cigar makers all over the place are working to get caught up and provide cigars to you so you can enjoy them on your holidays this upcoming winter. But I just want to show you some sticks right now that you can enjoy sort of more immediately for all of those of you who are like me and don't like delayed gratification. So if you're looking for a good new blend to try, this list should have something for you. And of course, as always, this is not a total list. It's not everything that's available right now. So I'll ask you guys, drop a comment down below. What is the new blend you've tried recently because of availability issues that you didn't expect to like, or maybe that you had never tried before? Put something that you just fell in love with down below. And with no further ado, let's jump into some new and available cigars. And the first cigar I want to tell you about today is the one I sparked up for this video, and that is Room 101's Doomsayer Aggressive. This thing is a Maduro blend that comes in at $7.50 a stick, and the price isn't even my favorite thing about it. It comes from the crazy, totally unhinged mind of Matt Booth. He's been blending cigars for a long time. A while back, he worked with Davidoff. Now he's sort of struck out on his own, and he's doing so well. Blends like this you can find in cigar shops in increasing amounts. This thing uses a Maduro wrapper over binders and fillers from Indonesia, Honduras, and there's a Pennsylvania broadleaf somewhere in the mix. Fun and exciting, but this cigar provides so much flavor and value for just seven bucks. The fact that it's actually able to be found is really impressive. And this year, as Christmas comes up, it's true. There may be a cargo ship captain who's playing with all of your kids' Christmas toys right now, and you can't do anything about that. But you sure can get one of these doomsayers in your humidor in a little less than a week if you grab it from Cigars Daily. And then you've got the Oscar from Oscar Valdera's Cigars. And as far as blending goes, this dude pisses excellence about as well as anybody. His original Leaf by Oscar line has taken the cigar world by storm and the Oscar Valdera stuff is only as good and better. This guy right here uses an Ecuadorian Habano wrapper over uh, Honduran and Nicaraguan binders and fillers. What's amazing about this blend other than the flavor is it comes in at 11 bucks a stick. So not a super affordable cigar, but you also get what you pay for with Oscar. One of the things I love about it, it's more than just a cheap gimmick where you get like a leaf as a wrapper on the bottom of this thing. It's actually amazing quality of the tobacco in the cigar that's going to give you incredible profile from the second you light it up until the second you put it down. And while you may be on the quest for the perfect wife, and by the way, good luck with that, you know that this cigar right here will always be in the mood. And while boutique cigar makers are working to get sticks on shelves, so are the heritage companies, the legacy guys who are time tested and assured. And I'm talking now about Padron with the Padron 2000 Natural. This is one of the all original Nicaraguan Puros, a cigar that every part of it comes from the same country. Really amazing. And one of the impressive things to me is not the age of this blend or how well or how long Padron's been doing it, but the fact that after all these years, the Padron 2000 is still like $6.40 a stick. Really incredible on price. They do a phenomenal job of keeping the price down, but still producing flavor. It's part of the reason that so many people worship Padron, like it's the only cigar that people should smoke out there. And if you want to get a Padron at six bucks and some change, you got one right here in the 2000. Now, if you start having like sudden chest pains, you can pick up the phone and call your doctor, and it might be a four month wait before you can get in to see anybody. But sure enough, if you want to spark up a Padron, you can get a hold of one and light it up 
on the very same day. And if you're looking for a cigar that's truly robust and rich and bold, you should check out El Huehuense, the Wise Man Maduro. This 5.5 by 50 Robusto comes in at $10.70 a stick, which is pretty pricey, I think, for some smokers' budgets. But when it comes to this cigar, what you're getting is all that value. The value of a cigar that's a top 25 blend, it's been rated 90 plus a bunch of times, but mostly it was blended by Nick Melillo. The original blender of Liga Pravada cigars. The dude has a special weird love affair with the leaf and he's not ashamed to turn it into amazing flavor. This is one that cigar smokers are loving and lighting up again and again and again, even at that $10 price range. It's so impressive and so incredible. So much more incredible than like, I don't know, when you call your bank to get info on an account and then they just say, because of excessive call volume, we can't take your call, try again another day. Can you believe that kind of stuff is actually going on? They have your money. I feel like something like that shouldn't be okay. And of course, it wouldn't be one of my lists if I didn't have a blend from American Viking Cigars. And that's partly because I know these are available because we hold the national supply here. But this is the Obrigado Toro. It uses a dark Nicaraguan Habano wrapper over Nicaraguan binders and fillers. And it clocks in at just $8 a stick. One of my favorite things about this blend is this one of the, it's the first banded exclusive blend we put out before making American Viking Cigars. And to this day is one of the most highly rated and reviewed cigars on CigarsDaily.com. It's an amazing blend that people are falling in love with all over the place and truly, while half the country is out waiting for fast food jobs to pay 30 bucks an hour, you can get one of these for eight bucks and it'll hang out with you for 90 minutes. And like I said, those are just a few of the cigars that I know are really good and totally available right now. I hope you'll look for them at your local cigar shop, or you can find all of these on CigarsDaily.com. We're a family-owned and operated company, and we want to rock your world with amazing customer service. At the same time, I want to ask you to comment. What are the cigars that have rocked your world? Maybe you've tried something new, a new blend, or a new brand that you never would have thought of just because the shops were out of your favorite thing. I hope there's something incredible. And if you're looking for more recommendations, check the comments because the guys and gals in the Cigars Daily Nation are amazing about good recommendations. And again, check this video out on CigarsDailyPlus.com because we're always working to make it better on Cigars Daily Plus. Thank you all so much for watching. This is Tim signing off for Cigars Daily, and I will see you in the comments.